हेलो स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज डॉक्टर अमरप्रीत कौर अ लेक्चरर फ्रॉम जम्मू एंड कश्मीर एजुकेशन डिपार्टमेंट टुडे टॉपिक इज बायोडाइवर्सिटी कंजर्वेशन इट इज मेड अप ऑफ टू पार्ट्स पार्ट ए व्हाई शुड वी कंजर्व बायोडाइवर्सिटी एंड पार्ट टू द वेज ऑफ कंजर्वेशन ऑफ बायोडाइवर्सिटी आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विथ पार्ट ए दैट इज वाई शुड वी कंजर्व बायोडाइवर्सिटी and i will begin with a question and the question is what will happen to a food chain if we completely remove one tropic level from the food chain think for a while okay did you got any answer okay i am going to answer what will happen it will collapse okay not only this a food chain it can be a part of food web and not only of a food web but in nature many food webs they are interconnected so ultimately removal of species or extinction of species is going to create imbalance in nature and it is big threat not only to animals and other species but also to human beings so we have to take care of biodiversity okay there are many reasons why should we conserve biodiversity and they are grouped into three categories one is narrowly utilitarian broadly utilitarian and ethical firstly i will talk about narrowly utilitarian utilitarian means for practical use okay so why we need food, why we need biodiversity for utilitarian or narrowly utilitarian firstly for food all the food that we eat comes from biodiversity firewood certainly it comes from biodiversity from jungles we need fiber for our clothes for creating mats and different use different type of uses okay so fiber is coming from jute flax hemp cotton and other sources then th thirdly it is construction materials timber timber is used in construction purposes for example in furniture musical instruments and sport goods and all it comes from woods from jungles okay and another factor is industrial products tannins lubricants dyes resins perfumes paper rubber and many more products they are obtained from woods that is jungles or forests and drugs okay all the raw material it is provided by the plants near about 25000 species of plants they contribute to traditional medicines now broadly utilitarian biodiversity plays major role in ecosystem services okay for example we obtain oxygen oxygen is product of plants okay so if we cut down plants we will not able to get sufficient oxygen another is pollination the fruits the crops everything that we eat actually is the product of pollination suppose if pollinators for example bees bumblebees birds bats they will die will the pollination will be possible certainly it will not be possible by human way okay thanks to these pollinators that we are getting sufficient food the other broadly utilitarian uh, is aesthetic pleasure i will give example of our own kashmir when we are bored of our routine life so what we are doing we are going into jungles of gulmarg of our own dood patre and sonmarg there are so many places okay we have tulip garden so it is giving us pleasure another thing is is flood and erosion control so because of forests we are not getting floods because the roots of trees they keep soil intact and prevent it from soil erosion but once we cut down the trees what is happening the soil it becomes prone to 
erosion students in every religion there is teaching that we should not hurt other animals and plants and there are certain religions like hinduism in which they 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 worship certain trees okay the trees for example banana tree banyan tree um and tulsi all these are worshiped so it is our ethical and moral duty not to destroy nature okay because a time will come when nature will take revenge so if we want a few good future a healthy future it is need of our to protect biodiversity thanks for listening to this lecture if you have doubt you can visit my website and post over there